Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Jorge, Stephanie, Fatima, and Joanna. Hi, teacher. How are you today? It, it is raining cats and dogs again in San Miguel. What's the weather like in San Salvador? Is it raining? No, teacher. No. No? Okay, no. so it is raining. I am hot, teacher. You're hot, I imagine that. Uh, yeah, it's raining a lot. It began raining or it started raining about five minutes ago, probably. So we'll see. Hopefully it's not going to affect the connection, right? And maybe uh, you will listen to me or you will hear me clearly. In this moment, um, can you hear me well? Good night, good evening, Hello, teacher. Good evening, <laughs> Monica. You are in Sonsonate, right? Monica? Yes, teacher. Is it raining in Sonsonate right now? And no. No, okay. Uh, so it's only. Por el momento, no. Como puedo decir por el momento? <laughs> At the moment. Do you say for the moment in English? At the moment. <laughs> Not at the moment. Uh -huh. okay. Not at the moment. At the moment. No. <laughs> okay, excellent. Thank you so much. Uh, we continue with the next one. Uh, so Nelson and Lorena. Can you listen to me? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you for letting me know. Uh, okay, now I see Maybelline on the camera. I see two Jorge's, one Joanna, one Monica. Okay, very good. Hey, Maybelline, how are you doing today? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. So, uh, we're going to get started. It's going to be a little bit noisy, just a little bit noisy. Va a estar un poquito ruidoso. Uh, but I will try to speak as clear as possible, right? So that you listen to me, everything is good, and we can practice, okay? We can practice. So, what did we do yesterday? Do you remember? What did we do yesterday? Can anybody tell me? A light and dislike. Okay, we practice specifically lights, right? We're talking about preferences in music, in movies, Bless you. And thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Hey, Rosemary and Roxana. Welcome, ladies. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Okay, so we're going to get started. Right now, we are going to do one little um, dynamic, let's say, or one little activity that is called Two Truth and One Lie. Two truth and one lie. You are going to do this in uh, small rooms, in the breakout rooms. Hopefully the rest of your classmates join us right now. So the idea is the following, okay? Pay attention. I'm going to show you. Here we go. Hey, Jesus, Catherine, Norma, Irene, Juan Fernando, welcome. 
Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Okay, if you hear there's a lot of noise, it's because it's raining here. It's raining a lot in San Miguel. So, um, but the connection is stable, let's say. So hopefully nothing's gonna happen. Hello, Miguel, welcome. Okay, good evening. Nice. Good evening. So um, I'm going to share the screen so you can see what I was telling you. Okay, here it is. To truth and a lie. So that is the activity that we're going to do. How do we do this activity? Very simple. You are going to write down in your notebook if you want, uh, two things about you that are true and one thing that is a lie, that is not true. For example, I'm going to mention three sentences, okay? Number one, um, I live in Samuel. Number two, I like animals. I like animals. And number three, uh, I am married. I am married. So, I think, well, let's say, imagine that you don't know me, right? Imagínense que no conocen nada de mí. Um, if I say those three sentences, which one would you say that is a lie? ¿Cuál de esas tres pensarían que es una mentira? I live in San Miguel, I am married, and I have, I like animals. I live in San Miguel. Si no me hubieran conocido, hubieran pensado de que no vivía en San Miguel, probablemente, ¿ok? Porque la mayoría son mis Ok. La mentira en este caso, yes. I am married. I'm not married, ¿ok? So that's what you're going to do right now. You are going to write down three sentences about you. ¿Ok? Escriban tres oraciones sobre ustedes. Dos van a ser ciertas y una va a ser falsa. But you have to make it difficult, right? No van a poner una oración. I am Jorge. Es, sería muy fácil de decir que es verdad. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, oh, I have blue eyes. Tengo ojos azules. Y lo ven en la cámara que tengo ojos azules. Van a saber que es cierto. Okay. So that's what you're going to do. So in this moment, please, you have one minute to think about three sentences, okay? La pueden decir en el orden que ustedes quieran uh, in the breakout room, okay? Los voy a mandar a los breakout rooms para que adivinen cada quien cuál es la, la verdad y cuál es la mentira de las oraciones que van a decir. Okay, so How many minute, truth, teacher? Two truths and one lie. Dos verdades y una mentira. Okay, welcome Raquel and who else is here? Yeah, just Raquel and Jocelyn. Okay, perfect. So as you are finishing, I am going to create a breakout rooms. So you will go and share your answers or your sentences with your group. Okay, so you are 20 right now. I am going to create seven or six. Six would be better. 
Okay, so the majority of the groups have three, one group has four. So what you're going to do is to read the three sentences and your classmates are going to say which one they think it's not true, okay? And let me check it out. Okay, so um, one by one, one by one, okay? One by one. Uh, Jorge, we have two Jorge here. Let me check. Room number five. And... Okay, so in this moment, you will have exactly four minutes. Okay, four minutes to share the information in the breakout rooms. And uh, you have to say, right, if it is true or false. Eh, dicen las tres oraciones en cualquier orden. Sus compañeros adivinan cuál cada uno piensa que no es cierta. Y luego ustedes van a confirmar o a, o a denegar, okay, si es cierto o no. So, how do you say uh, es cierto? How do you say es cierto in English? It's true. It's, it's true. true. It's true. true. It's true. How do you say it's false? It's false. False. It's false. Okay, correct. So, go to the breakout rooms right now. Okay, Raquel, Catherine, and Jorge. Okay, perfect. So everybody, everybody's in the room. Now we're going to check group number one. ¿Cuál es la verdad? ¿Cuál es la mentira de la cosa? Okay. Okay. Uh, no, Bye. I live in San Salvador. I like pizza. I like the Beatles. Please repeat. I live in San Salvador. I like pizza. I like the Beatles. The Beatles. Help. I need somebody help, just anybody. <laughs> okay, what do you think is false? Which one? Do you I'm a lawyer. I live in Santa Tecla. Which one is true and which one is false? True. Oh. She live in, she live in Santa Tecla? True. True. <laughs> false? She have um, children, a children. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I don't have children. <laughs> I'm a lawyer. False. Liar, okay. No, it's true. I'm a lawyer. <laughs> it's true. Not a liar. Okay, uh, she's a lawyer. Not no, a law lawyer. Not a lawyer. Okay. Is it a lawyer? Abogada. Abogada. <laughs> no. <laughs> Um, is false. Yeah. I, you are like animals. No. <laughs> it, it's false. <laughs> I have twenty six years old. I am twenty six. I am twenty six. I am twenty six. Is that false? Yes, it's false. <laughs> ah, what is your age? Uh, twenty one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, Fatima. Vaya. Vino tarde otra vez. What? <laughs> no. Don't tell me you already finished. Pero, pero, 
me adivinaron. Okay. <ríe> no me adivinaron cuál es la falsa. Tengo dos verdaderas y una falsa. Ah, ok, ok. okay. I have a flower. I live in Lourdes. And I like animals. You finish? Yes. Hey, teacher. Okay, yes, teacher. so I'm going to tell you three. Okay? okay, for me. And you tell me which one is not true. Okay, okay number one. Uh, I have three sisters and three brothers. Uh, number two. I have one dog and one cat. And number three. I have, uh, well, I don't like, I don't like coffee. I don't like coffee. So three, which one is not true? The first one, you have three sisters and three brothers. That is true. Really? Yes. Eh, la segunda yes. creo yo que es la falsa. No, 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 We're back. Now I, I use the microphone. Now, uh, we're going to wait for the rest of your classes to join us. So as I told you, right, uh, you had to identify the one that was a lie. So good job. And now we're going to continue with the next part. So quickly, I am going to call out your name. So please just say, uh, present, right? Or absent. If <laughs> there's silence, that means the person is not here, right? So let's check it out. Um, first person that I see. Wait a second. Okay, were you able to identify the information that was not true about your classmates? Did you guess the, the lie? Adivinaron la que era mentira? Yes. Yes. Also. yes. yes. Okay, perfect. So, um, this is an activity, right, to know each other a little bit more because today we are going to be practicing with some conversations. So the first thing that I see, well, the first person that I see here in the list is Irene. Okay. Okay. I, I try to speak loud, okay, because uh, as I told you, it's raining a lot, so it's a little difficult to, to hear clearly. Uh, so Irene is here, Fatima. Fatima is here, yes, no? I think she was connected, but on the bus. She was on the public transportation. Jessica, not here. Here, hey. teacher. Okay, there you are. Thank you, Jessica. Hey, Jesus? Here, teacher. Okay, excellent. Joanna? I'm here. Jorge? I'm here, teacher. Ismael? Ismael is not here yet. Jocelyn? I'm here, teacher. Good. Jose Alberto? Absent. Uh, Juan Fernando? Present teacher. Carla Maricela. Not here. 
Uh, well, probably it's raining. But that's the reason why she cannot connect. Uh, next one is Catherine. Here. Kenya. Now here, Lorena. Here. There you go, Mario. I hear teacher. Excellent. Maybelline. Present. Miguel. Present teacher. Miguel and Miguel Guardado. Present. Okay, Monica. I'm here teacher. Natalia. Present. Nelson. Present. Norma. Present. Raquel. Present. Ricardo. Not here. Eh, Rodolfo. Not here. Eh, Rosenberg. Not here. Eh, Rosemary. Present teacher. Roxana. I'm here teacher. And Stephanie. Present. Okay, so it's time for the picture. I'm going to take the screenshot. Let's see how many people have their cameras on. Okay, the majority of you. Awesome. I'm going to check it out. In three, two, one, don't move. Perfect. Thank you so much. We'll continue with the class. So, um, Thank you to the people who already sent me the, the recording with the conversation about, do you like rap music? That was, well, pop music, right? That was really good. I listened to around seven people who sent me the recording. So that's, that's a good practice for you. Now, let's continue. Um, it's truth and a lie, here we go. So, uh, yesterday we finished with the conversation, right? Uh, as you remember, and the, we stopped or we finished in the grammar topic. So we were talking about questions, WH questions with do, yes, no, and WH questions, right? So for example, Rosemary, do you have children? Yes, I am. I do. Yes, mm, okay, I, yes do. I do. Okay, very good. Uh, Raquel, do you have a brother? Yes, I do. Okay, Norma, do you have a sister? Yes, I do. Okay, let's continue with the next person. Wait a second, what happened? Okay, here. So, uh, Jorge, do you live in Santa Ana? Do you live in Santa Ana? No, I do. No, I do or no, I don't? No, I don't. Okay, correct. Jocelyn, uh, do you have a best friend? Yes, I do. Okay, Juan Fernando. Uh, do you go out every weekend? Do you go out every weekend? Do you? Cada fin de, do you go out every weekend? Sale cada fin de semana? Yes, I do. Okay, very good. Let's continue with Catherine. Catherine, um, do you have a big house? No, I don't. No, you don't. Monica, what? No, yeah, Monica. Do you live uh, with your family? Yes, I do. Okay. Maybelline, do you like rock music? No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay, let's continue with Irene. Irene, do you usually watch... Um, Netflix? Yes, I do. Okay, next one is, what's next? Wait a second. Lorena, um, do, you, do you listen to Perreo music? 
sometimes? No, I don't like. No, you don't like it? Okay. Mario, uh, do you have a girlfriend? Mario, we lost connection. Uh, Miguel Hill, Miguel Alexander, uh, do you play soccer? Yes, I do. Okay, Miguel Angel, do you play basketball? No, I don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Okay, let's continue with, who's missing? Rosemary. No, Rosemary already answered the question. Stephanie is the next. Stephanie, um, do you visit your family every weekend? No, I don't. No, you don't. Nelson, do you have a laptop computer? Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Okay. Um, Who's missing? Who's missing? Quien falta? Who's missing? Um, Fatima, can you hear me? I think not really. Roxana. Yes. Okay, Roxana. Uh, do you? Let me check. Do you like? Dogs and cats? No, I don't. You don't, okay. So that's a very simple yes, no question we do, right? Now, that's a yes, no, right? WH question is different because we can ask the question what, where, who, when, etc., etc., etc. Okay, so uh, let's complete the conversation. That was part of the assignment, right, for you. Number one, what is the compliment here? You like science fiction movies? Do you like? Do you like, correct. Answer? No, no I don't. I, I don't. I don't like? I don't. Like it. Like me, like you, like him, like her, like it, like us, or like them? Like it. Like. What are we talking about? Primero tienen que identificar de quién estamos hablando o de qué estamos hablando cuando utilizamos el object pronoun. Estamos hablando de science fiction movies. Movies. Is that like, singular like, or plural? Sí. Movies. Plural. plural. So plural. we're talking about they. Uh -huh. So I don't like. Como ahí le pongo el plato. Them. Them. No me gustan mucho. Okay. Number two, Jake and Lisa like soap operas. Does. Nope. <laughs> Do? Do Jake and Lisa. Um. Because we talk about plural, they, right? Jake and Lisa. Okay, uh, letter B, I think Jake. Jake do. do or Jake does? Do. do. No. Do. Si solo, do. solo hablamos de él, he yes. does. Uh -huh. He, she, it does. Does. So, for example, how do you ask the question, eh, le gustan las novelas a tu mamá? How do you ask that question in English? Le gustan las novelas a tu mamá? Does, does, you, does your mother does or does she, she uh -huh, like soap operas? Soap operas. Okay, don't forget here, right? Does. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Okay, WH question. What does he play, right? So we talk about that. Okay, for example, um, does Lionel Messi play basketball? 
No, no he, doesn't. he doesn't. Does he doesn't? Okay. Mm. Does the president of El Salvador speak English? Yes. 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 He, yes. Yes, he, he, he does. Yes, he does. <laughs> uh huh. So yes, don't forget. He. Don't forget. Right. I'm going to annotate here uh, on the side. We use do for I, you, we, and they. We use does with he, she, and it. So don't forget about that. Okay. Um, let's talk about the Titanic movie, okay? Uh, does the Titanic movie last for around four hours? Dura alrededor de cuatro horas la película Titanic. Does the Titanic movie, I'm going to write the question in the, in the, on the screen. Does the Titanic last, durar, the tiempo, right? Last around three hours? Yes or no? Yes, yes, I do. Yes, it does. Yes, uh -huh, yes. It yes, it does. It does or no? It does. No, it doesn't. Okay, correct. Okay, next. Uh, I think Jake does, but I don't know about Lisa. Why don't you ask her? Why don't you ask? Her, that's correct. Why don't you ask her? Yes? Why don't you ask her? Okay, we're talking about Lisa. Okay, question conversation number three. What of music? What word is missing here? What word is missing? ¿Qué palabra se falta? Kind of? Kind. Or what? You can say what kind or you can say what type of music, right? What kind of music? Noriko and Ethan. Nos referimos a una persona o a dos? Two. So, Two. What is, so we say? Yes. Do. 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 Do Noriko and Ethan like because do is for they. Uh -huh. They. Very good. So let's continue. Um, here, right? Do they like? What kind of music do they like? They love classical music. Noriko really likes Jojo Ma. Uh huh. What is the question? Does he play? Does she play? Yeah. Okay, la respuesta es the cello, el cello. Aha, uh -huh. it's a WH question. What does he play? Pay attention here. What does he play? ¿Qué toca? Right? Referiéndose a los instrumentos. ¿Qué toca? What does he play? Play is not only jugar. Play is also tocar un instrumento. Play. Okay? Or play the music, right? Play on the on the radio, the on the stereo. You say play the music. Okay, what does he play? The cello. I have his new CD. Let's listen to yeah. it. Let's listen to it. So that is the answer. Congratulations. Glad for you. So thank you so much for sharing your answers. Uh, you can take a screenshot if you want, so you have the answers. Uh, or the information there. We continue with the next one, okay? Um, one, two, three, a little picture for Instagram. No, nah, just kidding. What's your favorite social network, guys? By the way, I forgot to ask you. If we have to vote, what do you prefer, Instagram or Facebook? 
Instagram. 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 Why? Why Instagram? It's more interesting. Because it's more interesting. Okay. Because you have because you have filters too, right? It's more popular. It's more popular, yes. Okay, and you see more pictures and videos, right? So, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's true. Instagram is more popular than Facebook. And now let's continue. It, which do you prefer to chat? WhatsApp or Telegram? WhatsApp. What's WhatsApp. WhatsApp. Okay. WhatsApp. You prefer WhatsApp. Okay, excellent. Now, pronunciation, guys. So when we're asking questions, we have two different types of intonation. Okay, la entonación es distinto al stress. El stress, ¿se acuerdan que es donde va la mayor fuerza de voz en la palabra, verdad? Yes? Okay. But intonation, right? Intonation has to do with really? Wow. I don't know. Do you know? So, is rising or falling? Okay, tenemos rising intonation, va hacia arriba. Falling intonation, va hacia abajo, right? So, listen and repeat. Do you like pop music? Do you like pop music? Do you like pop music? Do you like, Do you pop, like music? pop music? Pop music? Do you like pop Do you music? Do you, you like, like pop, music? pop music? Okay. What kind of music do you like? What, what kind of music, music do you like? Music you like? What kind of music do you like? All right? So it goes. What kind down. of music do you like? Excellent. So normally, normally, yes, no question is up. And WH questions go down. Okay? Normally. So if I ask you a question, hey, how are you? Or how are you? Hey, how are you? Right? It's normally like that. How are you? Uh, do you like music? Do you like dancing? So it's usually up. Uh, now, you're going to practice these questions uh, and you are going to answer the questions, okay? Practice the pronunciation and pr answer the questions. So now you're going to do the two things, okay? Van a practicar la entonación de las preguntas y las van a responder in the breakout rooms. But this time it's going to be in purse, in purse, not in groups, in purse. So we're going to uh, create 12 breakout rooms because we have 24 students. Ready? You have exactly three minutes, maximum three minutes, okay, to practice this. So um, yeah, we have time. Three minutes, please take a screenshot of the questions. Take a screenshot because you're going to practice asking the question and answering the questions, okay? In purse. Ready, set, and go. Three minutes beginning now. Right on time, Fatima. Okay, go to the breakout room. Jorge with Javier, Monica with Stephanie, Jocelyn, Catherine, Raquel, Rosemary, Miguel, Roxana, Jesus, Mario, Joanna, Miguel, Juan, Natalia, eh, Irene, and Fatima. I'm going to move Fatima to practice with Irene. Okay, go to the breakout rooms, please. Mario, Miguel, Stephanie. Hello, hello, Mario, Miguel, and Stephanie. Can you hear me? Perfect. Stephanie and Mario. So I'm going to send. Hi, teacher. Okay, accept the invitation to go to the breakout room, please. Stephanie?
Seems like you have some connection problems, Mario. Hello, hello. Ladies, can you can you hear me? Fatima and Mirene. Second, somebody's alone. Si quiere, puede empezar a preguntar usted. Vaya. Eh, do you like TV? Do you like TV? Uh, yes, I like. Okay. Yes, I do. Do you like, do you like music videos? Mm, yes, I do. Hello, Maybelline and Jose. Esto es de rato estoy esperando, pero creo que alguien está haciendo el problema, porque le estoy hablando. Uh, I'm sorry about that. This is room number 11, right? So I'm going to move Nelson here, maybe. We have good luck with Nelson. Yeah, some people are having connection problems. I'm going to move Jorge. Hey, Nelson, can you hear us? Yes. Okay, so you can practice with Maybelline quickly. You have just one more minute. Okay. Um, do you like movies? Movies? Yes, I do. Yeah. What kind of movies do you like? Okay. I like horror films. Hello, Jorge. Hi. <laughs> okay, ask her, ask him some questions, please. You have just around 30 seconds more. Okay. Do you like TV, Jorge? Yes, I do. Do you like music videos? Repeat, please. Do you like music videos? Did you finish? Yes, solo eran las preguntas que usted había dejado, ¿verdad? The questions that are in, in yeah, on the screen. You have around six questions. Did you answer no. the questions? Did you answer all the questions? ¿Respondieron todas las preguntas? Yes. Okay, excellent. So we're going to go back to the plenary. In a... Me escuchó. Uh, can you repeat, please? The, the initial thing. <laughs> um, spell. Uh -huh. Ahora sí. S O A P O P So as we wait for the rest of your classmates uh, who are finishing their conversations, we are going to check, right? WH questions. Uh, you were in a rush, Fatima. You were in a rush, like. Lo siento. No estoy en casa. Uh -huh. Don't worry, it's okay. 
Um, now, we were practicing some questions, okay? And I'm going to ask some people, right? So let's see, the first person that I'm going to ask is Catherine. What kind of uh, programs do you like? What kind of uh, TV programs do you like? Um, makeup, beauty, sneaker. Ah, beauty, beauty, beauty programs. Okay. Beauty programs. Do you like sitcoms? <laughs> sitcoms is new vocabulary. I'm going to write it down in the chat. Sitcom, uh, it's it's an abbreviation for situation comedy. Son todos los programas parecidos a Friends. Okay. Ah. Oh, so those are sitcoms like. The Big Bang Theory, right? Mm -hmm. How I Met Your Mother, Orange is the New Black, uh, Modern Family. So those are sitcoms, okay? Mm -hmm. Sitcom, yeah. new vocabulary, write it down in your notebook, right? So let's continue. It's situation comedy. Now, uh, talk shows is like uh, Aso Cerrado, right? Or I don't know, those kinds of shows. Um, so operas, you know, right? Uh, like Televisa style. And we continue with the next one. Next question is for Jesus. Um, what musical instrument do you play? I play the guitar. Oh, nice. Really nice. Um, let's see. Here, Fatima, do you like music videos? Do you like music videos? I like. Yes, I do, or no, I don't. That's yes, short, I do. Okay, that's a short answer. Very good. And one more question I'm going to ask uh, Miguel Hill. Do you play a musical instrument? Do you play a musical instrument, Miguel? Yes, I do. Which one? I play the guitar. The guitar, okay. Similar to Jesus, very good. So we can have a band here and you can sing music in English. Okay, now, um, who likes singing in this group? Who likes singing? Raise your hand if you like singing or use a reaction or activate the microphone and say, I do. A mí me gusta, I do. Who likes singing? A quien le gusta cantar? Who likes singing? Is different? A quien le gusta cantar? Okay. Y quien puede cantar? Bien, verdad? Así que no se preocupen. Si ustedes dicen, me gusta cantar, pero no canto tan bien. That's okay. I like singing, but I don't sing so well. Okay, I like singing, but I don't sing so well. Only in the shower, right? Um, so, like me, right? I, I'm not a good singer, but I like singing. Now, let's continue. It's like dancing uh, or cooking. Maybe you like cooking, but it's not so good. We continue with uh, the role play. So right now we're going to practice conversations, okay? In, uh, let me share the screen. Okay, quickly. So we're going to do the role plays because you're going to be taking different roles to ask questions. And the conversation that you're going to practice is the following, an invitation, okay, an invitation. So we have Dave and Susan. Um, I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Okay, so please read, read aloud along with me. Read aloud along with me. Uh, for this, you don't have to activate your microphone, okay? No tienen que activar su micrófono, si lo hacen, no hay problema. Leer en voz alta a la par mía, okay? One, two, and three. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks, I love to. What time does it start? At eight o'clock or at eight, right? That sounds great. So do you want to have dinner at six? Huh, I like to, but I had to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. 
Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. So that's what you're going to do right now. I need two volunteers to practice the conversation, please. Raise your hand, Roxana, and another volunteer. Jesus, okay, Jesus and Roxana. Then we continue with Maybelline and Juan Fernando. Okay, Jesus, you're Dave, Susana, you are, I mean, Roxana, Roxana you are Susana. Susan, okay. I was like, Susana, Roxana, similar, right? One, two, and three. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I love to. What time does it start? At 8 a.m. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at 6 o'clock? Uh, I, I like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7 and a half. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you here. There. See you there. Very good. So congratulations, class for them. See you there. So in this case, the question that you are practicing is would. Would you like, right? So it's a new question. Now let's continue with Jesus and Maybelline, right? No, it was Juan Fernando, I think, and Maybelline. I'm not sure. Okay. Yes? Yes. Okay, ready, set, and go. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? I love to. What time does it start? At eight o'clock. That sounds great. So do you want to have dinner at Six o'clock. Um, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around seven thirty. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. See you there. Very good. You can use the reactions, please. Claps for them. That would be all. And we have the last two volunteers, right? We have Rosemary and Jesus. One. Okay. One, two. What? Sorry, Jesus. Uh, yo fui el primero que me pasó, creo que Jorge. Ah, oh, true, right? Uh, Jorge, what's the next one? So, who wants to practice with Rosemary? ¿Quién va a hacer la conversación con Rosemary? Me, teacher, Jorge. Jorge, okay, perfect. One, two, and three. I have... I have tickets. I have tickets to the soccer... Max on Friday night. On Friday night. Thanks. Um, I love, love to. I, I love, love to. to. Yeah. What time does is it start? At eight o'clock. That sound great. So, do you want to have dinner at six o'clock? Oh, I like. To I have to work late. Okay. Oh, thanks. Okay, let's you meet at the stadium before the match around seven and a half. Okay. Okay, let's meet at the gate. At the gate. That's Sang, sound fine. See you there. See you there. Okay, guys. So Excellent. You practice this conversation. Uh, tomorrow you're going to practice in the breakout rooms. Okay. So you have the opportunity to 
uh, practice individually, right? Because I want everybody to practice. But right now, because of time, we're going to stop in this part. So what I need you to do, what I need you to do is to, at home, right? Write down five questions, okay? Five questions, making an invitation. Making an invitation to a person, okay? To different things. And tomorrow in the class, you are going to practice with different people asking for a different questions, asking different questions for an invitation, okay? So you are going to use this format, this format. For example, would you like to go out on Friday? Would you like to go to a soccer match? Would you like, would you like, te gustaría, right? Would you like to uh, have dinner? Would you like to go for a coffee? Would you like to go to a concert with me? Okay, so you need to create five questions. Tienen que crear cinco preguntas con este formato. Um, como invitando a hacer distintas cosas o a ir a distintos lugares a un compañero. Okay, so tomorrow you practice. Yes, I would. Yes, I love to. Thanks. Yes, I really like to go. That's affirmative. Okay, negative. Una forma sutil de decir no. I like to, but I have to work late. I like to, but I need to save money. I like to, but I want to visit my parents. Of course, you can invent your excuses, right? That's okay. Uh, for example, if I say, hey, uh, Maybelline, would you like to go to a party on Sunday? And then Maybelline is like, um, no, my, my boyfriend is angry, is jealous. So, no me puede decir no porque mi, no, mi novio es celoso, right? She can say, um, I like to, but I, I have to go to the church. Me, me gustaría, pero tengo que ir a la iglesia, right? So, no, but the, the, the party is at night. Yes, but I, I go to the church at night. Ah, okay. So, next time, next time. Una forma de esquivar las invitaciones no deseadas, right? So that's uh, what we're going to practice tomorrow, right? So what you can do here in this to practice is to do this exercise, letter A. But for today, that's all, okay? Lo dejo ya con uh, el anticipo, el adelanto de lo, de lo que vamos a estar haciendo. Uh, so you can practice with this exercise. Quickly, I am going to uh, take the final picture with you for today. So it was nice to see you all. Uh, let me check right here. Okay, one, two, and three. Nice, I see Norma on the camera. Joanna, Raquel, Miguel, well, the two. Yeah, Monica too, one, two, and three. Perfect. I, I think we better take a crazy picture, but another day, not today. Del relajo. Now, let's continue. Eh, Irene? Present, teacher. Present. Okay. Stephanie? Stephanie Herrera? Roxana? Present, teacher. Rosemary? Present, teacher. Okay, very good. The next one is Raquel? Present. Norma? Present. Nelson? Present. Natalia? Present. Monica? Present. Miguel Angel? Thank you, Monica. Present. Miguel Alexander? Present, Present teacher. Maybelline? Present. Mario? Present teacher. Lorena? Lorena? We lost Lorena. Uh, Catherine? Present. Then we have Carla? Juan Fernando? Present. Josué Alberto? Josué, no. Jocelyn? 
Present. Mael. Jorge. Present teacher. Nice. Joanna. I'm here. Jesus. Here, teacher. Jessica. We lost Jessica's connection. Okay. Eh, Fatima. I'm here. Irene. Well, I already said Irene is here, right? So excellent. Thank you so much, guys. Have an amazing night. Hopefully it rains in your cities. Espero que llueva por ahí. Um, so you can sleep like an angel, like a baby. So I will see you tomorrow, okay? At the same time, the same place with the same t-shirt. Uh, well, the same t-shirt. Hi, teacher. No, same t-shirt. <laughs> okay, not the same t-shirt. Now let's say goodbye. Take care of yourself. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye, bye, bye guys. Bye. 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 Bye, bye, teacher. Bye, bye. Don't forget to write the questions. Okay.